Hello, UGTRB English, Unit 8, English Language and Linguistics, MCQ, Part 1. Question number 1. Which of these is a historical approach to language? Historical approach to language is diachronic approach. Question number 2. Which symbol represents phonetic transcription? Phonetic transcription is a symbol. Option A, double slanting line. Phonetic transcription is normally placed within double slanting line. The study of signs. The study of signs is called semiology. The study of signs is called semiology. Words with one syllable is called monosyllabic word. Our two syllable ruler word is disyllabic word, three syllable word, that is trisyllabic word, more than three, it's called polysyllabic word. Question number five. Question number five. Question number five reads like this IPA stands for, IPA stands for. International Phonetic Alphabet IPA stands for International Phonetic Alphabet Question number 6 The linguistic branch that deals with scientific study of meaning Scientific study of meaning uh, Linguistic branch is semantics Question number 7 The minimal meaningful unit is the minimal meaningful unit is morphine. Minimal meaningful unit is morphine. Who used the term langua and perone? Who used the term langua and perone? It is Ferdinand de Sazua. Question number 9. Who defined the language as a system of signs? Who define language as system of signs? It is Ferdinand de Sazua. Question number 10. The part of linguistics that studies the relationship between language and cultural behavior. Language and cultural behavior and the relationship of Padika linguistic branch. The answer is ethnolinguistics. Ethnolinguistics is also known as cultural linguistics. Question number 11. A regional variety of a language is called. A regional variety of language is called. Regional variety. It's called dialect. Or what are our Question number 12. Semantics is the study of. Semantics is a study of word meaning and interpretation. Word meaning. Semantics. Question number 13. Historical linguistics focuses on. Historic linguistics focus in. It is language change over time. How does language change over time? In Parker Kudia, historical linguistics. What does syntax study? What is the work of syntax? It syntax studies sentence structure and arrangement. Syntax studies. Sentence structure and arrangement. Question number 15. Which type of linguistics involves the study of language variation and its social implication? Language variation, you know, other way, social implication in your particular linguistic branch is sociolinguistics. It is called sociolinguistics. Morphology deals with morphology deals with word formation and structure. Question number 17. Phonetics is concerned with speech sounds and their production. Phonetics deals with speech sounds and their production. Which branch of linguistics focuses on the structure and rules of language? At a given point of time, 
language and structure and rules evari irundathu endra padikkukoodiya linguistic branch is synchronic linguistic that is approach Ling synchronic linguistic now question number 19 what is linguistics linguistic is the study of languages and their structures it's a systematic and scientific study of languages and their structures question number 20 what is a sociolect sociolect avadhi enna sociolect is a variation of a language based on social factor social factor based panni or language la irukkakoodiya variation question number 21 what is an idiolect idiolect is a personal variation of a language or thani navar and the language eppadi varied a pesuraaru maatri pesugirar that is called idiolect question number 22 what is meant by code switching code switching is switching between different languages or dialect and the ability of the person to switch from one language to the other or one dialect to the other uh, at a given instance that is code switching question number 23 what is pidgin pidgin is a simplified language used for communication between groups with no shared language or kulu mattum thaniyaga pesuvadharkaga uruvaakapatta oru moli that is called pidgin phonetics is concerned with the study of speech sounds in spoken language spoken language that is the answer question number 25 how many vowel sounds are there in english language and uh, english language la irukka kudiya vowel sounds 20 12 plus 8 12 pure vowels 8 mixed vowels 12 pure vowels are also called as monotongs and 8 mixed vowels are called diphthongs thank you hope this video was useful if you like please um, click the like button if you have any queries please uh, drop a comment and if you like the video share and do subscribe for this video wait for more videos to come thank you